welcome to my channel and welcome to my favorite series of video what inspires me today i will be showing you paintings by kinoka craft artist behind the coloring book myths and magic where i recently finished two pictures and of course before i started to color them i went to official site of kinoka in order to get some inspiration and I was totally mesmerized by her magical paintings. So Kinoka Craft was born in Japan and she began painting quite at early age. Then she graduated from a college of fine art in Japan and then decided to continue her studies in USA, in Chicago. In 1970, she started her career as a uh, freelance artist and she produced art for various publishers, for uh, book covers, for il magazines, illustrations, then some paintings for theaters, for advertising agencies and so on. Kinuka illustrated the most famous fairy tales, classical fairy tales, and I would say that her illustrations are one of the best I've ever seen. She illustrated Cinderella, Sleeping Beauty, Twelve Dancing Princesses and Beauty and the Beast. Recently I finished to color her line art picture of Beauty and the Beast. And all these books, they are available on Amazon and I would say that they are amazingly beautiful. Then I also went and I read her interview and it was really very interesting to read about her um, art process. She said that she really liked to read, so it's um, one of the sources of inspiration for her. Then, after she got initial idea of her next painting, she created more than 100 sketches before she finally decided about composition. Then she hired some um, models and she started to do digital uh, photos and then she gradually started to create her um, more detailed sketches. Also, it was very interesting to learn about her technique. For me, it was quite unusual. She works on board prepared by gesso. Then she uh, do first painting using watercolors. She says she said that she prefer Winsor and Newton watercolors, and then she seal layer of watercolors, and she start to work on top of it with oil painting. With all paints, for me it's quite unusual technique, but probably it's the reason why her paintings look so magical. I hope that even if you don't own myth and magic coloring book, you still will enjoy paintings by Kinoka Craft. And I decided to tell you why I love her paintings. First of all, because I can clearly see that for some of her paintings she was inspired by Renaissance art and by works of Pre-Raphaelites and I also love their art. Next, I really love when she creates relatively dark background and the main character, main figure is drawn with very light pastel colors, with a lot of light some kind of light halo around. I really love this contrast and I definitely plan to use this difference between dark background and pastel colors for the main characters in my colorings. Next, I would say that she has a wonderful way of coloring hair of all colors. Ginger color, platinum blonde, dark brown everything is so realistic i definitely have to have second and third look so i will be studying her way which colors she used for each and every color of the hair next i really love her magical blue color which she uses a lot and how she combined this blue color with lavender with pastel yellow with peach so 
it's one of my favorite combo color combo and i also plan to use it more when i will be coloring other pictures from myth and magic coloring book and the last thing that on many of her paintings we have so much of the golden light so many golden elements warm yellow light and it's other detail which i definitely also want to try in my colorings personally i really enjoyed coloring her line art coloring book and i can highly recommend it it has decent quality i enjoyed working on that paper with polychromoses, but I think that it's possible to use also water-based mediums. Probably the book isn't for the very beginners, but if you feel adventurous and a little bit more confident in your skills, this coloring book definitely can be interesting for you. Or maybe you can use one of the wonderful color combos from Kinoka Craft Paintings on your other coloring books I thank you for watching. In the end of this video, I will leave a link to the whole playlist What Inspires Me. And as usual, thank you and I will see you very soon. I wish you a very pleasant weekend.